Ladies and gentlemen, this is the co-main event of the evening. Scheduled for three two-minute rounds in the Tough Enough Light Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner with a record of four wins and three losses. Fighting out of American Kickboxing Academy, Las Vegas, Nevada, Lee Cordova. His opponent stands across the cage in the red corner with four wins and four losses. Fighting out of 10th Planet Jiu-Jitsu, Vista, California. He is Elijah Harris. Your referee in charge of the action inside the cage is Frank Trigg. All right, guys, here we go. The light heavyweight division on display here in the co-main event of Festa Brawl. Tough enough. Amateur fighting championships here in Las Vegas. Gorgeous George and Phil Baroni and the Goes. Shit on shit early, man. I hate that one. Yeah, really. Elijah yeah, Harris. opened up a cut. Oh, really? <laughs> on this shit, yeah. Look. Oh, wow, Elijah Harris. Going for the takedown there. Lee Cordova's got the uh, light blue and blue and navy blue and turquoise blue trunks. Really trying to fight this tight down off. He's to cut over. Yeah, he is. But he needs to get some underhooks. Oh, look, it works. There is a cut there on the shin. Both of them have it, actually. Those are like pretty big gashes, too. Some big balls being thrown by both guys. I think the referee is taking a look at that cut. Goes for a single there. Elijah Harris working against the cage there, trying to make something happen. Cordova looking to get off that cage. Referee Frank Trigg comes in. Doesn't just break them apart. It looks like he's calling time, and he wants to have the doctor take a look at this cut here. You know, it happened on that very first strike of the fight. You can hear that thud. Well, they both have it. I think it was just a cut to let it go, but it's a, it's a big cut on both guys, so there must have been quite yeah. a collision, huh? That hurts clanking shins like that. It definitely hurts. Looks like the doctor's communicating with the referee. She may be calling the fight. She oh, is. Wow. Wow. She's calling the fight. Neither fighter's happy about that. Both of them want to continue. The doctor trying to explain what the situation is there. You know, I don't know if it was one of them worse than the other. Both fighters want to go. You know, maybe we could take this in the parking lot and finish it, right, guys? Yeah, why not? <laughs> wow, this is unfortunate, man. Some big boys were trading some bombs there. But both of them have deep cuts there on their shins. Very first strike of the fight, too. <laughs> the referee saw and studied it for a while, brought in the, the doctor. She took a look and said, no, we can't continue here. We're going to see if we can get a little bit of clarification on why she exactly stopped it. It was perhaps uh, blood after the fight. Maybe you can mosey roving, on. Roving and, reporter? Yeah, can you do right, that? Yeah, I'd like to find that. out, you know. I think the audience would like to find out as well. Both guys getting tended to right now. and It's unfortunate, you know, they go through these camps. The fans come out and they want to get down. They, they want to win, they want to lose. They don't want to lose, but they, they're willing to accept losing. They want they to wanna fight, they want to fight. Yeah. It's got to be pretty disappointing. Well, we're going to send it up to Justin Bernard. He's going to give us an official announcement right now. All right, we got some clarification from the commission. What it was is the cut's just too big. They can't close it. It's going to continue bleeding throughout the fight. All right, so no break or nothing like that? No, Ladies no, and no. gentlemen, after one minute, 12 seconds into the first round, there is no winner due to no contest. Due to both fighters injured and doctor's recommendation to stop the fight. We appreciate you fans understanding that the staff, the doctors, and the ISK are simply looking out for the safety of the fighters. They come out here, put it on the line for you for free. 
and they don't want it to end like this either. So let's hear it for these two warriors, Lee Cordova and Elijah Harris. Wow. They do it for free and for the fans. The crowd obviously disappointed, but hey, we have to understand that the doctors are looking out for the athletes. And uh, it's their decision to let them fight another day, so. You know, I'll tell you what, if this is painful now, wait till tomorrow morning. Yeah, definitely. All right, well, that's the co-main event in the book, folks. No winners, no losers. It's a no contest here for Lee Cordova and Elijah Harris. We're going to be back with the main event here. The ladies get down in the Bantamweight division. It is a title fight. Valerie Cantero versus Jessica Sargent.